The Chaminade High School Science, Technology, and Research Center, located at the intersection of Emory Road and Jericho Turnpike, promises to revitalize our science, technology, and research programs with the best resources available. Our investment in this 34,000 square foot project will move Chaminade from adequate to exceptional in STEM education for all of our students. The South Steps, one of the three main entrances, lead up from Ott Field into the center's atrium. This will serve as the primary entry for students coming from the main building. Across from the South Entry doors, a 12-ton floating staircase connects the atrium's three floors. Illuminated by natural light from expansive glass walls, a tiered platform in the southwest corner will provide a gathering and seating area for students. Opposite the windows, a three-story living wall displays perfectly preserved plants, mosses, and lichens. Next, we enter the Science Olympiad Lab, more than 40 times larger than its current facility. The Science Olympiad team will now have enough space to host competitions. Like all new labs, this room includes a specialized teaching wall. When powered up, the lab's long interior glass wall will become opaque and serve as a smart board and projection screen where students can work collaboratively and give presentations. Traveling north, our incoming earth science students will enjoy over twice as much space to examine rocks, minerals, and fossils, conduct experiments, and analyze results. In this lab and throughout the building, we find computerized lab probes. These digital scales, calipers, thermometers, and spectrometers will all feed raw data to a central processor, which will then feed the information to students' iPads in real time for group analysis. Across the hall, we find the Sal Trenikos Physics Lab. Like the biology and chemistry labs, this lab is 30% larger than the original in the main building. Its purposeful layout will direct students' line of sight to the teacher's platform. A significant improvement over all of our old labs, this will make demonstrations and instruction more effective. Below us in the center's basement, you'll find more than 10,000 square feet of flexible use space. Two-thirds of that space will host a fabrication and robotics lab. Here, 3D scanners, 3D printers, metalworking tools, and AutoCAD-equipped computers will empower students to design parts, construct their own robots, and compete in elite competitions. Ascending the stairs now, we pass through a three-story glass-enclosed staircase overlooking Jericho Turnpike. On the second floor, the biology lab's expanded ventilation system will vastly improve our handling of fumes from dissections. A fleet of new digital microscopes will be added. An anatomage digital anatomy table will allow students to section and anatomize a 3D virtual life-size human body with x-ray and surgical simulations. Across the hall, the new chemistry lab's powerful fume hoods will allow our students to work extensively with hydrochloric and sulfuric acid and conduct acid-based titrations, redox reactions, and metal replacement reactions. As we exit now, we draw your attention to a prime example of our interactive teaching walls in use. The research lab next door will allow students to explore human and translatable science, including the foundational methods used in drug development, gene analysis, and forensics to provide a completely sterile environment for cell culturing. Here we find an incubator and laminar flow cabinet. We will also incorporate DNA PCR amplification tools and DNA sequencing technology not commonly available to students until late collegiate and post-grad science courses. As we turn left out of the research lab, we enter the second floor landing. Landings will include tables and chairs for collaborative learning. To our right, in the open center of the floating stairway, a Foucault pendulum will hang. For observant science students, measurable shifts in the pendulum's oscillations give proof of the Earth's rotation. As we pass the third floor living wall, floor-to-ceiling windows provide panoramic views of our eastern and southern campus. On the third floor, we find a large open space suitable for alumni events and receptions for up to 250 people. 
complete with a terrace overlooking Gold Star Stadium, Ott Field, and the main building, this space will be the only one of its kind at Chaminade. For our earth science, oceanography, and research students, here we will house a multi-purpose teaching flume, a permeameter, a hydrodynamic simulator, and a river flow simulator. Every square inch of the Science, Technology, and Research Center at Chaminade High School is designed with purpose and efficiency. Even the center's rooftop. No matter the weather, students may study the world. Above our campus as well. The center's rooftop is designed to accommodate both scientific instruction and environmental stewardship. The rooftop will feature an open meteorological observation deck for the study of atmosphere, weather, and sunlight. A digital programmable telescope for instruction in astronomy will reside in our observatory dome. A low-density soil mixture will manage runoff and host a community of native shrubs and grasses. Their leaves will shade the building from direct sunlight during the day and insulate the building at night, thereby mitigating both our cooling and heating costs.